This is Dr. R. Anil Kumar, and I am pleased to welcome you for this second session of online classes. I hope you understood the previous tutorial on creating motif designs. In this tutorial you will learn on how to change pattern colors, changing the size of the motif, relocating motif, transforming and duplicating motif. So without wasting any time we shall proceed further. Let us launch Adobe Photoshop. Click on File and New. Type the name as Spot Motif. Width as 500 pixels. Height as 500 pixels. Resolution to 300 pixels per inch and click OK. Go to View and Extras to remove the grid lines visible in the document. Click the Custom Shape tool which you can find in the last of shape options in the Tools palette. We can now control the properties of the custom shape tool found below the menu bar at the top of the screen. Select a color for the shape and, click in the shape option in properties bar. Select an ornamental shape from the shape option. Click and simply drag within the document. Note that by simply clicking and dragging won't result in a balanced shape. Click delete in the keyboard and hold shift key in the keyboard and drag within the empty document. Now a filled shape is created. Using the move tool position the motif to the center of the document. Click on Image and Mode. Select Indexed Color. Click OK to flatten the layers. Now the Indexed Color dialog box appears. From the Palette option select Local Perceptual and click OK. Again go to Image and select RGB Color. Using the magic wand, click on the motif to select the motif. Click on edit and fill. Select a weave pattern from the custom pattern we had already created. Keep the blending mode to darken, and click OK. Now we need to reverse our selection to select the background. Go to Select and Inverse. This will now make a selection to the background. Click on Edit and Fill. Select a weave pattern from the custom pattern we had already created. Keep the blending mode to Normal, and click OK. Now the weave is applied to the background. Click on Edit and Define Pattern. Type the name as Spot Motif and click OK.
click on file and new type the name as all over motif width as 500 pixels height as 500 pixels resolution to 300 pixels per inch and click ok go to view and extras to remove the grid lines visible in the document click the custom shape tool which you can find in the last of shape options in the tools palette click in the shape option in properties bar now a library of different shapes can be seen select an ornamental shape from the shape option and hold shift key in the keyboard and drag within the empty document now a filled shape is created click the fill color in the properties bar select a color to change the color of the motif click on image and mode select indexed color click ok to flatten the layers from the palette option select local perceptual and click ok again go to image and select rgb color using the magic wand click on the motif to select the motif click on edit and fill select a weave pattern from the custom pattern we had already created keep the blending mode to darken and click ok now the weave is applied to the motif go to select and inverse this will now make a selection to the background click edit and fill select a weave pattern from the custom pattern keep the blending mode to normal and click ok right click and select deselect to remove the selection now the weave is applied to the background press ctrl plus plus key in the keyboard to zoom in to see the weave pattern click on edit and define pattern type the name as all over motif and click ok click on file and new width as 3000 pixels height as 3000 pixels resolution to 300 pixels per inch name as spot motif 1 and click ok click on edit and fill select a spot motif pattern from the custom pattern we had already created keep the blending mode to normal and click ok now the weave is applied to the background now let us duplicate the document click on image and duplicate the duplicate image dialog box appears with the name spot motif 1 copy now you can notice that another document with the name spot motif one copy is created click on image and adjustments and select hue saturation the hue saturation dialog box appears in the hue option you can now slide into the left or right to change the color of the weave click ok select the spot motif 1 and go to file and save as spot motif 1.jpg and click ok now select the spot motif 1 documents copy and go to file and save as spot motif 1 copy.jpg and click ok Go to File and New. In the new dialog box, type the name as Spot Motif 4, width as 3000 pixels, height as 3000 pixels, resolution to 300 pixels per inch, and click OK. Using the eyedropper tool, select the desired foreground color and fill in the document using the paint bucket tool. go to edit and fill select the motif pattern from the custom pattern keep the blending mode to multiply and click OK
Press Ctrl and Z in the keyboard to undo the last process. Go to Edit and Fill. Select the motif pattern from the custom pattern. Keep the blending mode to overlay and click OK. We can see that changing the blending mode will have impact on the color of the document. Click on File and Save as Spot Motif 5.jpg and click OK. Go to File and New. In the New dialog box type the name as Spot Motif 6. Width as 3000 pixels. Height as 3000 pixels. Resolution to 300 pixels per inch and click OK. Using the eyedropper tool select a contrast foreground color and fill in the document using the paint bucket tool. Go to edit and fill. Select a motif pattern from the custom pattern. Keep the blending mode to darken and click OK. Click on file and save as spot motif 7.jpg and click OK. Go to File and New. In the New dialog box type the name as All Over Motif 1. Width as 3000 pixels. Height as 3000 pixels. Click OK. Go to View and Extras to remove the grid lines visible in the document. Go to Edit and Fill. Select a motif pattern from the custom pattern. Keep the blending mode to Normal and click OK. You can now zoom in the document using Ctrl plus plus key in the keyboard. Click on File and Save as Spot Motif.jpg and click OK. Go to File and New. In the New dialog box set width as 3000 pixels. Height as 3000 pixels. Click OK. Using the eyedropper tool select a light color for the foreground and fill in the document using the paint bucket tool. Go to Edit and Fill. Select a motif pattern from the custom pattern. Keep the blending mode to overlay and click OK. Click on File and Save as All Over Motif 2.jpg and click OK. Click on File and New. Width as 500 pixels. Height as 500 pixels. Resolution to 300 pixels per inch and click OK. Click the Custom Shape tool from the Tools palette. Select a color for the shape and click in the Shape option in Properties bar. Now a library of different shapes can be seen. Select an ornamental shape from the Shape option. And hold Shift key in the keyboard and drag within the empty document. Now a filled shape is created. To change the size of the motif, click the shape layer from the layers palette. Press Ctrl and T in the keyboard. Now a bounding box appears around the motif. Hold Shift key and click and drag the corner point towards inside to reduce the size of the motif. Move the motif to the center of the document. Click on Move tool. Press Alt key now click and move towards outside to make a copy of the motif. Press Ctrl and T reduce the size of the motif and position the motif to the document. We can also see that Photoshop has automatically created a copy of the shape in the Layers palette. In the Layers palette, right click on the shape copy and select Duplicate Layer. Click OK. Using the Move tool we can now move the overlapping shape to the top of the document. 
Now in the Layers palette click on Shape 1 Copy 2, press Shift key in the keyboard and click on Shape 1 Copy. To select both the layers, right click, and select Duplicate Layers and click OK. Using the Move tool move two duplicate copies to the right of the document. Click on Image and Mode. Select indexed color. Click OK to flatten the layers. From the palette option select local perceptual and click OK. Again go to image and select RGB color. Using the magic wand. Click on the motif to select the motif. Click on edit and fill. Select a weave pattern from the custom pattern we had already created. Keep the blending mode to darken and click OK. Go to select and inverse. This will now make a selection to the background. Click on edit and fill. Select the all over motif pattern from the custom pattern we had already created. Keep the blending mode to normal and click OK. Right click and select deselect to remove the selection. Click on Edit and Define Pattern and click OK. Go to File and New. In the New dialog box set width as 3000 pixels, height as 3000 pixels, resolution to 300 pixels per inch and click OK. Go to Edit and Fill. Select a motif pattern from the custom pattern. Click OK. Click on File and Save as Motif Design.jpg and click OK. That's it for now. You can practice yourself by creating motif patterns from Photoshop's built-in shape tool. I hope this tutorial was useful to you. Thank you all for listening to me. I will again come to you with another useful session on textile design. Till then this is Dr. R. Anil Kumar, Assistant Professor in Textiles and Apparel Design, Periyar University, Salem, India. Bye-bye.